What's up, TDS family? It's your boy, True Dark Seed, coming at you with another Let's Talk while I'm on my way to work. Man, look. First of all, Rob, much love. Hope you're doing better. Yes, I'm doing the other 21 pilots, but uh, I, you know I had to hop on the Pete and Bass, which brings me here today. Also, I see my boy Snoop and the, and the, and the East Siders done drop something new. So, you know, I got to get on that, too, because, you know, it's Uncle Snoop. But we are here to talk about Pete and Bass. I done listened to that song like three more times. And I just woke up. Took my shower, got ready and got ready for work. I'm on my way to work. That, that. Outside with the fag and the and the stout with his top off. The feds come around the man when it pop off when it when it pop off and I still make the drop off. That that float and rhyme pattern right there was sick as all get out. Like absolutely ridiculous. Every time I hear this song, I hear something, something new. I saw, I saw, I, I, I breezed through some of the comments, so I'll, I'll get to like real answer them when I, uh, when I uh, get to work at lunch, whatever. They'll get answered today. So thank you. I understood that uh, stick means means gun, and, and but I, so it didn't hit me that the, the chopstick. Split them in the middle like a uh, chopstick. I didn't know chopstick also meant uh, a sawed-off shotgun. That makes that bar even harder. Oh, my God. Because you got a double-barrel shotgun that split down the middle. The two barrels are side-by-side side with the split in the middle. Then you split the chopsticks when you break them in half. And he was on that on that, on the Chinese food scene. Ski, uh, skiing. Chinese bok choy. Oh, my dim sum. Come on. I can't, I cannot get over just how good these guys are. Like, like upper level good with the pen. Upper level good with the pen. It's Mickey flipping outstanding. I can't, I cannot wait for this album on the 22nd of November. What? What? Dang, I still make that drop off. Man, that's look, they did look. I, I I need to see him in I need to see him live now. I need to see him in person. I need to I need to meet these guys. I this these guys are so so inspirational, right? They, mm, they so inspirational that show you that look. Age don't mean nothing, especially in the rap game. And it's just sad that, you know, hip hop out of all genres of music don't really respect the the older generation. Right? They figure after you yeah, after you you hit your forties you should be done rapping. But a lot of times, you know, most of the times if you really live it. That's when you really start having something to say. And that's when you start really having fun because you start losing the, I don't care if this makes me anything. I just want to make music and say what I want to say. These 76 years old, dude, killing it. Absolutely Mickey flipping, killing it. Their music right now is hotter than than a lot of a lot of people's music that are a quarter of their age, a third of their age. You know what I'm saying? I 
I know I'm inspired. They got me inspired to, to, to do this thing. Man, I almost wish I could spit bars. What else? What else? Uh, the six, six, the six, six man deep. That, that was all. Awesome. That was fire. That was fire. What else? I, there was. There's so much about this song. There's so much about this song. I just. I can't even verbalize it. I'm still like, I'm going to be listening to it as soon as I, uh, I got it queued up right now to listen to it when I get finished recording this video. But, man. They my favorite British rappers. They my favorite, favorite British rappers. The way they play off each other, the back and forth, it's so effortless and so smooth and non-forced. It's just mwah, so good. <sighs> Pete and Boss. Y'all, man, y'all real ones. Y'all real ones. I love the fact that T-Pain hopped on there with y'all and okay, the remix and put it all together. It's good to see that. Man, I mean, when y'all coming to the States, when y'all coming to the States, you got to come over here. If you come, if you come anywhere near Detroit, I'm there. I'm, I'm telling you, I'm there. That's, that's it. That's all I got to say. Oh, less than, uh, 25, we 26, sorry, 26 away from 10K. Hopefully we hit 10K this weekend uh, so we can go live. But uh, so I want to thank y'all, all y'all for uh, for subscribing and putting up with this old broken tooth, wild old man. It's much love, much appreciation. Uh, I'm going to keep it with because of Pete and Baz. That is the inspirations like Pete and Baz. I'm gonna keep going. We can make 10K, we can make 100K. Ain't that right? All right, good people. That's all, I, I know I just got on here and ramble, but I couldn't, I just had to get it off my chest. I did, I just couldn't do it. That's what these lex, that's what these lex talks are about. Something, when I have something I need to get off my chest, I get it off my chest. All right, I love you guys. Y'all have a blessed day. I hope everybody is uh, is well, and hope everybody in y'all family is well, and I'll catch y'all on the next one. Deuces.